Here at Conquer Movement, when we're working with patients, we use what's called an I3 model. And what this is, I3 is, it's three words to start with the letter I, genius, right? Um, this is a spectrum of care or a spectrum of places where we kind of find our patients. So the first I is incomplete mechanics. Excuse the handwriting. And then we have incidents. And then the last I is injury. Okay. Incomplete mechanics are things that aren't moving well or are moving differently than they should. It might be limited range of motion from one side to the other. It might be muscle stiffness one side versus the other. Maybe we have a butt wink in the bottom of our squat or our knee caves in during different activities. But these are just variances in how we move. And incomplete mechanics don't lead to injury, but what they lead to are incidents. And incidents in this stage of the spectrum is where, um, you know, you're still training, you're still staying active and doing everything that you love, but maybe you wake up with a little bit more soreness than you have in the past, or maybe you got to pop an ibuprofen and then you're good to go in a few hours. Uh, maybe you got to take a couple extra days off, uh, but you're still in your training and you're not significantly limited and you're really not having too much difficulty. But what happens is these incidents over time, if we don't address these incomplete mechanics and we allow these incidents to continue to happen for prolonged periods, then that's where we find ourselves at this stage in injury where we're having pain, we have inflammation, and it's now preventing us from doing the things that we love. Maybe we're still lifting, but we're going, ah, I'm avoiding leg day today, or uh, I'm gonna keep my squats really, really low, or I can't do barbell deadlift because it hurts my back, so I'm gonna supplement with this exercise. Whatever that is, that's where most of the clients that we see here come in. Unfortunately, we wait too long till we get to this point to dr then try and clean things up. Whereas if we can get in and address the incomplete mechanics before we get to this end of the spectrum, we can really help prevent um, some of the issues that a lot of you are dealing with. So this is our thought process here. And the incomplete mechanics are what we often describe as the root cause. You'll hear me if you ever talk to me talk about the root cause of an issue. And that's usually the driving factor. So if we can fix the root cause and eliminate the incidents, and keep you free from injury, that's our ultimate goal in using this I3 model. If you have any questions about how we work with clients or this I3 model, feel free to uh, shoot us a direct message or an email or leave some comments below.